We're going on a money hunt. I've got my bank account. I'm not scared. There's a very popular children's song or a series of children's songs that uh, sing along those lines. Uh, essentially, they hunt dragons, bears, and all kinds of fun stuff. Uh, anyway, you're in the car with me today as I'm driving home. So I have no idea the sound quality, but um, here we are. Also, the video's vertical. <laughs> so let's do a little update, huh? Because I got a few minutes before I pull into the house. Um, scams suck. It's It does not feel good. And I really want to release a video about the five stages of grief and how they relate to my experience. Um, you'll see that maybe tomorrow, maybe, uh, you know, in the near future. Uh, so turned in the report to the FTC, um, that's the Federal Trade Commission, and um, the bank has been putting their fraud and disputes department through their, through their steps. Um, we had money credited back to the account. The email they send to that, it, you know, I'm a little emotionally wrecked from this experience, right? And the email they send is like, we can take that money back at any time. If we see that this fraud wasn't actually fraud, we're just, we're just gonna take it right out of your account. And I'm like, oh, okay, well that's nice. That's a good feeling. It's like we got the money back, but at any second we might not have the money back. Uh, okay, so my wife is the eternal optimist. She's like, there's no way they're gonna take the money back. Do you have any idea how often this happens? And and you, you, no, no. So, uh, and there's nothing to say that this wasn't fraud. I mean, in the first hour after the transactions, we were in the bank going, whoops, and <laughs> reported everything. So, it, I don't know. It just made me a little nervous reading that email. Um, and shortly after that, uh, none of our debit cards were working. So, that was an interesting debacle. Um, but recently I just bought some food with the debit card. So now it's working. I have no idea. Um, the funniest part of this whole thing is during the scam, we didn't have enough money to keep me out of jail. Haha. <laughs> but it wasn't keeping me out of jail. It's just a scam. <clears throat> Whatever. So we call some family and family, God bless them because they're like, Hey, don't worry about a thing. We're going to help you out of this. Luke's not going to jail. <laughs> awesome. So they wire us some money. And then we gave their money away to strangers. Uh, yeah. That's another great feeling to have after being scammed. Is you don't just lose your money. You lose your family's money. Ah! Anyway, um, that's all been resolved. And I will try to not freak out about it from here on out. I'm definitely calling a therapist. Um, whew, so we get their money back and now we have our money back and it's in our bank account. And so we want to do the right thing and send our family back the money that's theirs. It's their money. <laughs> and so we go through the medium that our bank uses to send money and there's a limit on how much money we can send. Okay, that's fine. We'll just do multiple transactions to send them their money. Um, first transaction goes through, family member acknowledges, hey, I got some money, like awesome. And we try to do another transaction, it's like you can't, you can't do that. It gets put on hold and our daily limit of what we can send is uh, met. Um, so that's cool, whatever. But then today I'm at work and I get a call from the bank and they're like, whoa, 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 whoa. We know you ain't responsible enough to do this money transfer thing. So we we need to talk to you immediately uh, about some money transfer activity yesterday. It seems weird. <laughs> and I'm sitting there like, um, you can see the name of the person we're sending it to. That's the same person that the funds were were given to our account from. <laughs> just a few days ago. We're just trying to give our family money back. We can't do that either. So the, the wonderful, funny irony of all of this at the end is uh, 
<laughs> Even the bank's like, you, you can't do anything with the money. Either A, we're going to take it back from you, or B, you can't send it back to the proper owners. So uh, in the next few days, that'll all get sorted out. Family will have their money. Hey, kids. I got to go. I hope you have all a, a wonderful weekend. Stay safe out there. And uh, more to come. So <laughs> have a good Friday.